The Supreme Court, in a landmark judgment of Friday, May 24th, affirmed the ruling of the Court of Appeal that disqualified the candidates of the Xamfara State Chapter of the All Progressive Congress from participating in the 2019 general election. The Appeals Court based its ruling on the ground that the primaries conducted by the State Chapter of the APC was not in line with the provisions of the Electoral Act. Acting on the judgment, the leadership of INEC convened a meeting where the issues at stake were deliberated. Addressing a press conference at the Commission's headquarters in Abuja, INEC Chairman Professor Mahmoud Yakubu declared the candidates of the PDP winners in the governorship and National Assembly elections. That we had to first discount the votes cast for the APC at the elections and then carefully rework the spread by local government areas based on the new valid votes. In compliance with the Supreme Court judgment, the Commission has now determined the winners of the elections in Zamfara State as follows. Governorship. Governor, Bello Mohamed Matawale, PDP. Deputy Governor, Mahadi Ali Ogusau, PDP. Why the candidate of the National Rescue Movement was declared winner in one of the state assembly seats, the 23 others went to the PDP. The INEC boss, however, admonished political stakeholders to learn from the Zamfara experience. It is clear that properly conducted party primaries are cardinal to the proper internal functioning of political parties, the electoral process, and our democratic system in general. Therefore, Political parties must take very seriously the conduct of primaries according to all extant rules, including the monitoring processes by INEC, to avoid a repeat of the Zampara experience. Meanwhile, the electoral body has slated Monday, May 27th, for issuance of certificates of return to the governor elect, deputy governor elect, and the members of the National Assembly elect in Abuja. Chooks Ukwatu. CNN News.